I see you have returned, dear Saiyan. Thanks to you, my power will only grow to greater heights. Full beauty of this tyrant. Where is the text? Not even what a god did in the past can affect me. I can't believe he actually killed a Supreme Kai. But of course, as you know, only a Supreme Kai can wield the power of the time beings. To bring about the justice I desire, I needed the perfect sympathizer as my ally. A fighter I could trust, who agonized as I did over the folly of mortal kind. Someone I knew for certain longed for the same grand utopia in their heart. In other words, he needed me. In this reality you see as an ultimate future, I was floundering in despair. I lacked the will to act. I knew from the box of rings this parallel future existed, as I came to forge my alliance. Magnificent. The body of the Saiyan is the ultimate attempt. Foolish! You okay? I can barely feel a thing. What? Could be worse. I am a sinner, but I don't care. I'll do whatever it takes to save this planet. How it went. I didn't think you were capable of reaching this level of power. But it does make for the perfect dessert. Crap! My limitless wrath makes me the strongest being in the universe. Admit defeat. I'll hold them off and give them everything I've got. But in case I fail, you need to find a way to defeat them. Goku and the others are back, as expected. So, the curtain rises, and our Act 3 begins. Our Master Goesu and the other Kais were foolish enough to believe mortals could be entrusted with intellect. As a result... You, malefactors, have developed time travel. A privilege only meant for the Kais. This machine is the quintessential reason why your kind must be eliminated. Well, it appears they're not listening to you. 
No matter. I'm so intoxicated by myself, I don't care if I have an audience. One of the many benefits of being a god. Fine. What's done is done. I'd rather win with our fist than some magic trick anyway. <laughs> I was just thinking the same thing. are a gift from the gods, as is their energy. But you arrogant Saiyans act as if you created this strength all on your own. Could be worse. Now I figured it out. The reason for the runaway growth in your power level compared to my own. It's anger, isn't it? Watching us hurt your son made you angry, which made me stronger. So that's how Saiyan strength works. How primal, turning your raw emotions into power. Only a pathetic mortal like yourself could thrive on a tactic that unrefined. Which explains why it took me so long to realize it. Then I too shall use my anger. Anger toward the mortals who defile the universe. Anger toward the other gods who have tolerated such behavior. And most importantly, the white and hot rage I now feel toward myself for letting you get the upper hand on me in our battle. This was just the start. I'm channeling my divine rage into power. I have forged a new instrument with which to destroy you. This sign will carve a reminder into your mortal flesh of the strength of my divine wrath. Present. He must have run into some trouble completing his part of our gambit. Disgrace yourself against those mortals. We were barely separated. What went wrong? It seems many of our assumptions about mortals were badly mistaken. They are much more than just insignificant worms. If we're not careful, our dream of utopia is going to be ruined before it's even begun. Very well. No more games or half measures. Because these insolent mortals continue to defy and profane us, we will reveal to them the ultimate power of the gods. It's time to show them divine perfection made whole. You pathetic, lowly mortals. Kneel before our radiance! This is your move. Show your reverence and bow down before our splendor. Worship me. Give praise unto me. Me, the beautiful, the sublime. Me, the invincible, the almighty and divine. All hail, Samus. I can feel it. 
two glorious and unparalleled powers dissolving into one within me. So he's even stronger now. That's just what we need. The power coursing through me is exceptional. Glorious. Absolute. Staring all. I am justice incarnate. Trumps, keep Bulma safe! You insolent, minuscule saint. Bear witness as I show you the power of my divine light. Hearken unto me. I am the brightly glowing sun in the sky which illuminates this world. And also know that my brilliance is justice. I, the god Zamasu, am the universal wisdom, the universal law, and yes, the universal power. And all those who my light shines upon shall be oblivious. At long last, on this glorious day, Project Zero Mortis will culminate with the eradication of all life on this planet. Then, Utopia will rise from the ashes. What the hell is he talking about? Don't get ahead of yourself, Zamasu. First, you have to beat me. Lo, still denying the inevitable. Perhaps a further demonstration of my power will help you face the truth. Now, to rend the land, cleanse it of all that is impure. So begins the jubilee, heralding the arrival of a divine new world. This is the definition of justice. Power, wisdom, flame. It's over. Go kill! Samasu! Get ready, cause I'm knocking your lights out for good! You simple minded bother to say it. Life of the mortals that will soon be extinguished. Here we go! So we Break through the limit! Help me! Help me! Help! What? No! Impossible! Yeah. Huh. Huh. You okay? I can barely feel a thing. It's a great honor to fall at the hands of a god, is it not? Blasphemous fool, you continue to defy a god! Light of divine justice, strike at me now! A cowering god who appeases evil can never prevail! Who are you? Get ready for this! <laughs> ah! 
You two doubled up, so we did the same. You know, just to play fair. We're a merged fighter, the combination of Vegeta and Kakarot. Vegito! And here's something new. Vegito Blue! Try to emulate the divine. Now, why is that? Is it because we gods are so wonderful? Are you coveting our undeniable beauty? It's so tragic. You're doomed to fail. Active gods are beautiful because we are inherently pure, while mortal endeavors will end up. Wicked. Corrupted and marred by sin. Sorry, but if you want me bowed at your feet, you'll have to do it by force. I don't need your prostrations, mortal. I just need you dead. are the ultimate symbol of the failure of the skies. By taking the flesh to my being, I have assumed both sins of mortal kind and the failure of divinity, so they may never be repeated. Human power has failed before magic will ever again. Take this! Got an answer for everything, huh? You see, I do this for the good of the gods. For creation! Are you seriously crying? I am, and proudly so. My tears shall sanctify this blighted world. You must be expunged. A pure and perfect multiverse made clean by Zabasu's hands! Not yet! So... It's useless! Don't even try! Hit him! It's useless! Don't even try! All obstacles must be taken! You cannot keep up with me! Have dared to bear your fangs to the god! Zamasu! Back for more! Runs! Yes, I can! of the world is but another of a god's genius. <laughs> <laughs> I am everlasting! 
Because believing in our fellow man and helping each other to survive, that's what redeems us. That's what makes us who we are, makes us worthy. That's what gives us our real power! Death, strike God, and retaliate against justice! I don't give a damn about you or your so-called justice! <laughs> Go away! 